feel better when we're fighting together. Why don't we attack it with pyrokinesis? Use SAS! You sprayed something like oil. Don't get it on you. Go! There. Next. Like the enemy dropped something rare.
is this facility? It looks like some sort of assembly line. Hey, those boxes. Aren't they the same ones from that transport truck we saw? <laughs> what is it, Sugumi? Does it contain what I brought earlier? A human head. You've got to be kidding me. All of these? What in the world is this place? Others are being held in this building, and others feed on human brains. Even if that's the case, why does it seem like this factory processes the brains? I hate to say it, but couldn't they just toss in the whole head if they're just feeding them to the others? This smell... where is it coming from? It does smell a little strange here. Almost like... blood. Those ampules! I think... I'm going to be sick. This can't... be real, right? Those were made by Spring Pharmaceuticals. Looks like Kyoka couldn't lose you. What is this? I think you've already figured it out. This is Spring Pharmaceutical's Ceyron factory. To be more accurate, it's an other research facility they run jointly with the Ceyron government. They're using these heads to make their products. <sighs> Shiden, stay calm. Just concentrate on stopping Yuito. Wait! Let's talk! Hey! First you won't tell me why you're trying to kill me. Now you're trying to hide this cool place? Don't you feel anything seeing what's going on here? What are you all thinking? By any means. I thought you were amazing since you were a cadet, Asani. But now you're trying to kill Yuito and trying to hide this facility? What happened to you? This isn't like you. Shut up! Why? You don't know anything about anything! 
Then tell us! We don't know anything because you won't tell us anything! Drugs out of human heads is crazy! We have to stop them! But Naomi... She needs this. What do you mean? What is this facility for? That's... <sighs> I can't take this anymore. I'm telling them everything. No. I will. This place is an other research facility run jointly with Spring Pharmaceuticals, just like Arashi said. Human brains of people with powers are being brought here. A portion of them are transplanted into others to turn them into other weapons. The rest are turned into a medical solution to feed the others. That's horrible! Hey, are you really sure about Seiron? 
I know New Himuka has a lot of its own issues. It's not right that the government monitors everyone and controls all the information. But Seiron causing the uprising, that's just as messed up. Can we really let them get away with transplanting human brains into others or processing the brains into drugs? No, we can't, obviously. That being said, there are, in fact, some people who've been forced to accept it. Like my brother. And then there's Kasane. People whose loved ones have been turned into others. They depend on that medication. Human-born others can temporarily regain their senses when they take that medication. Even letting them talk. Does Karin have a family member that's been metamorphosed? No, not a family member. As Luca or Fabuki mentioned it. Alice? Yuito! His brain is... Yuito! Yuito? Is this happening because I used my power? My head is... killing me! Are you okay? What's wrong? You look like you're in pain. There's something wrong with Yuito's brain. He's beginning to show signs of speech and memory impairment whenever he uses his power. I'm okay now. The pain is fading. Sorry to interrupt, but you need to leave now so we can call this a draw. Hurry up, or the others will come. We should leave too. That okay with you, Kasane? Yes. Yuito, our assignment is complete. We should withdraw. Yeah. We should get out of here as soon as possible. Wataru said he would report to Major General Fubuki for you. Okay. Uh, sorry. I know I should be the one to do it, but I'm just not feeling well. What are you talking about? It's okay. Don't worry about it. We all know how you feel. No, that's not exactly true. I can't understand how much pain you're in. I probably would have taken the ampule too if I were in your shoes. I know saying that won't help with whatever guilt or disgust you might be feeling. Thanks. I'm okay. The medication should be chemically processed, so consider them more like protein or amino acid supplements. It may be unpleasant, but looking at them this way might help you come to terms with it. Yeah, I know what you're saying, but it's just hard for me to do it. I know it might be difficult, but whatever you do, don't throw them up. What? You knew? We... well... We saw it happen. You were outside the hideout. Oh, we're sorry. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I know it's not in my stomach anymore, but I just couldn't... It's fine, but you have to fight through it. You can't make it a habit. You're right. Besides, Naomi, it must be so much harder for her. Being turned into another is awful enough, but now she has to... feed on these brains? I don't know where she is right now, or how she's doing. When I think about her, I know how much better off I am. If Naomi hasn't given up, then I can't either. I know I can get through it. After you do get through it, he'll be able to help support Naomi when you see her again. Yes. You're right. I... I need to get it together. I'm just wondering if New Himuka is stocking up on those ampules, knowing full well what they're made of. If that's the case, and they do indeed know, then they're going to have to answer to me. No. 
I have a feeling that New Himuka already knows everything. I just can't get myself to accept it. I'm sorry. Huh? You don't need to apologize. You have nothing to do with the hospital. I know, but I just wanted to apologize. I want to look into the hospital and do something about it. This is a tough position for the both of you. You too, Luca. Everything Karin has done must be hard for you. Sugumi had to see a lot of things she never wanted to as well. I think we've all had our fair share of suffering. But what's important is that we continue to support one another, right? Yeah. Sorry I worried everyone, and... thank you. Didn't I have something to do?